Hi guys, welcome back to Pawan Education. So today in this video, you are learning about the how to represent root twenty on number line. Let us go to represent root twenty on number line. So first, let us draw the number line. So it is the number line. So draw arrows. So take a compass because the distance between the numbers on the number line must be equal. So I mark this point as zero. So mark this point as zero. So take a compass because the distance between the numbers must be equal. So I take and this is the length between the one unit. So it is one. It is two. It is three. It is four. It is five. So the left side to zero is minus one. So now mark all these points: zero, one, two, three, four, five, and minus one. So according to the concept of root twenty, first we want to draw a right angle triangle. So then only you can go to the represent root twenty on number line. For example, let us draw the right angle triangle here. So, right angle triangle. So it is a right angle triangle. So we can assume it as A B C. So A B is. So you know the A C is root twenty. Now we want to find the A B and the B C. So how we can write root twenty? So we can write root twenty as root of. So we can write it as sixteen plus four. So how we can write root twenty? So we can write root twenty as root of sixteen plus four. So how we can write root sixteen plus four? So we can write it as four square plus four as two square. So we can write it as four square. So root of four square plus two square. So according to the Pythagoras theorem, a c square equals to a b square plus b c square. So if you send the square, it get roots. So a c equals to root of a b square plus b c square. So now substitute these values here. So a b is nothing but four and b c is nothing but two. So a b is two units. And the BC is so BC is two four units. So AB is nothing but four units, and BC is nothing but two units. Two units. Now draw the same right angle triangle here. So first we want to draw the perpendicular here. So the base is four units, which is nothing but AB. Four units. So let us draw the perpendicular here. So draw a semicircle. So with this point, draw an arc here. It is sixty degrees. With this point, draw an arc here. It is one twenty degrees. With this point, draw an arc here. It is so. With this point, draw an arc here. It is ninety degrees. So now join this to four. So join this to four. Join this to four. So in order, the base AB is nothing but four units, and the BC is nothing but two units. So take a compass. So the length as the length of one unit. So with this point four drawing out here, it is one unit. With this point drawing out here, so it is one unit. So if we add this, we can get two units. So now join this to zero. So we can get. The right angle triangle, which is here, so join this to zero. So we know that it is four units. We know that it is four units, and it is two units. Two units, and it is AC is nothing but root twenty. So now take a compass. The radius must be 
the length of the root 20 which is nothing but AC. So this is the length of the AC root 20. So draw an arc. So here you can observe a cut. So it is the point nothing but root 20. Root 20. Like this we can represent root 20 on number line. In this video, I hope you all learnt about the how to represent the root 20 on number line. Thanks for watching. Like, share and don't forget to subscribe to Power Education.